I got three highlights I want to show, and then we'll get right into the video. Check it out. Gone. Okay. Look at that statue. Boom. Look at that debris just fly everywhere. I want to show you all something. Look at this right here. You have stealth takedown. Okay. And I needed to do that because look at there. Look at that damage system. Okay. Welcome to week three. And there has been a lot of progression and I could have kept going, but, um, I made the outpost this week and a little bit about this stage is a very small map, but it's packed with functionality from last map and the insurgents have built an outpost on top of a cemetery and the locals want us to go and clear it out. And that's exactly what we're doing. Okay. Let's talk about what you're looking at. Um, this time I focus a little bit on the lighting, um, learning volumetric fog. And we have the first thing that I really like is the character mesh. And that is the character skin. It's different from last week. Um, if you go back and look, I kind of tailored him. He has a white shirt. He has gray pants. And then look at the weapons. The weapon system is also in the game. Okay, different walk. Anim he's walking now. He, can be he backs up instead of just kind of doing a pirouette. Um, he actually has a roll system. Um, and this weapon switching system and all of the sound effects that go with it. Um, and then you remember last week I said, I wanted a ladder system. I wanted a weapon system and I wanted bots Well, we got them. The bot also is decked out in their skins. Okay. I have a character mesh for the bots as you can see them right there and they fight. And you remember I said, I wanted a fighting system Well, we had that. We got combinations, punches, and kicks. And we also had these stealth takedowns. Oh, and I missed it. You saw I said time to kill. So I need to, man, look at that. And so it's, a, it's like a combination of fighting and shooting. Kind of crazy. Okay, that's the end of him. Okay, but look, I got 51 health. So, look, reload animations right there. Let me go see if I could go around the corner. Okay, so this, what you're looking at, I got a road asset right here, and it's modular. I can put that together, um, and, and it's, it goes around the outpost, and we're going to get into the outpost I got a little bit of my favorite statues in here and they all have the damage chaos system attached to it, which is environmental damage. You can actually put environmental damage on the road, the buildings. Okay. That put me up to 81 and let's see if we can get, uh, let's see how I can go about this systematically a little bit better. Cause. Oh, ho. Look at that combination of takedown. Let me get out of there. Okay. So now another thing that I want to talk about is the cover system that we have. Okay. Oh, he's looking that way. Okay. And it's still three guys here. Okay, so let's see. He's now looking the other way. Cause, okay, so now let me get look at this cover system. Okay. You got a cover system. I have to put it on each element. You can look over the top. You can look around around each of these corners. Okay. And you can do all of this stuff. You can change your weapon. You can shoot over the top. And you can reload on it. And look at that cool reload animation. It's like the coolest thing I've seen. Get out of cover. All right, so now let's go up top. Because up top, 
it is a grenade launcher up there. And then here's the ladder system. I can jump on the ladder. Oh, look. He's there. He tried to knock me down. Okay. That's him. He's gone. Okay. So I wanted this grenade launcher up top. And this physics system's on everything. Okay, look, that might have knocked down one of the statues. I was going to show you all. Look at that. This statue is, is gone. Okay. Look at that statue. Boom. And look at that debris just fly everywhere. Yeah, this is crazy, man. Okay, yeah. You, you got you to with this grenade launcher. You're not going to win that battle, bro. You're not winning that battle. Hey, that's it with my grenade launcher. What you got left? Got that. I just got two shots in the shot. Yeah, okay, yeah, this guy is tough right here. Okay, and another thing. Oh, look at that. 21 health. He might get me. I knew he look how he pushed me. Oh my goodness. Okay. Alright, well, I got my health back. <laughs> okay, so. You saw, let me get in here and handle it. Man, he, okay. Let me see, what can I throw? I'm gonna throw a grenade in here. Man. Yeah, he ain't that smart. Yeah, see that shotgun up close. Except theirs work very good at distance. Uh oh, he got me. Oh, he had to reload. Uh oh, I had to reload. Oh my goodness, man. Okay, so as you can see, these are all the improvements. I wanted an enemy AI and I got one. All right, see, that's what I should have done in the first place. Okay, so. You can switch out. See, I got wrapped up into beating AI. I forgot I'm supposed to be telling you about the developments of the game. Now, you can see bullets that are being kept inside of the walls as you shoot them. Um, you remember last week, I didn't like the fact that the door swung out into you. Well, these right here, I programmed them just to slide open and close. So no matter what side you're you're on you won't have that problem with the door swinging into you and i also like the uh the sound effect on it okay open and close just like that and that chaos system is crazy okay look at that man that chaos system is so crazy so that's the game okay now you all get in the comments below let me know if this is something you would play let me know the progression of it because this is going to be a game for the community whatever the community wants however they want to go about it but this will be primarily third person tactical military shooter and that's what i'm going for and this is my progression for the week we had a we added a ladder we added cover system we got nice character mesh we have uh, a shooting system we even learning the damage system with the chaos system is way more than what i anticipated um volumetric fog we messing with the lighting it's just so many things that we're learning in just a rapid pace right here um that i'm almost ready to get to the networking um of it because the next thing that i want to do just like i called out what i wanted last week I want to have a character be able to network inside of this map as the second player and help me fight these insurgents. That is what I want to have to have this thing networked. And that'll just be another step in getting the game just completed. Because like I said, my goal isn't to create a whole Grand Theft Auto. I want to be able to learn all of these different things and then produce one battle royale map, put in all of the functionality, network it, and then let's go. Let's get the plan. So that's what I want to do. 
And um, it seemed like this is all right. Let's see if we can get that stealth takedown. Oh, look at here, man. Oh, damn. Man. Chill. So, man, this is fun. Uh, I'm going to go get right into the action. Probably get killed real quick. But just to look at a lot of this stuff on, see how the damage system feels. See that. Man, it, you talk about some action. Yeah, we got to get up out of there. Get straight to this health. Cover system. Look at there. Ho, 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 ho. Yeah, he don't want me to come up there with that shotgun and give him that work. Because I'll do it. Let's see if Buddy is around here. Oh, he jump kicked me. Man, this is this is fun. I ain't even gonna lie to you. Cause the AI is a challenge. gonna get me again yeah so this is the game that's in development right now <laughs> man i already see it's going to be once i get the right animation and get the guns tuned you might have a different game space okay he's down I want to see these rocks and stuff just blow up. Let's see. Get moved around. Look at that. Look at that damage system, man. Environmental damage. Yo, no telling how that's going to network, but we'll find out. Oh, yeah, buddy. You let me come in and just get it. Look at here, I can't throw. Is that area? Sound effects. Yeah, look, and then after the st after everything is over, just look at the total destruction. It feels like a war went down, right? And that's exactly what I wanted. Um, I mean, it's just everything that I wanted so fast, um, in terms of this development. Oh yeah. You, you won't let me step here. Oh, say. And then I like everything just has physics effects to it. It's not a lot of static stuff. Um, but that's, <laughs> that's what I had to offer this week, man. Like, let me know what you all think of it. And, um, and yeah, look at the blood there. Um, oh yeah. You can take fall damage if you fall from far enough away. Right. But it's other animations based upon how far you fall. So 
man, this is fun. I'm not going to lie to you. Like, it's literally fun. It's it's some things that I'm, I'm going to have to clean up and glitches and stuff like that. But it's an entire community out there that's willing and ready to help you. And this is only week three. Only going to get better from here. And uh, I can't wait. Very excited. Get in the comments below. Let me know what you think. Week three. Can't wait to see what week four has to bring in store. See you in the next video. Peace.